trying to navigate that world. I know a lot of people struggle with it too. Hot girls have stomach issues. What can I say? It's fine. No one will know, even though I literally just told everyone. Hello! Wait. Hey, vlog. This makes me want a Tesla so bad. Would you trade for a day? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Everyone's like, rebrand much? Hey. Skirt, skirt, and that's a parking <laughs> I know what you're thinking, Alicia, you got a matcha, you didn't get a coffee, like what's going on? When I tell you, I have been having so many stomach issues. TMI, my For You page on TikTok is literally like IBS shit. Like I swear, I I don't know. And I know they say hot girls have stomach issues. Like that's a compliment. Like, wow, we'll d bestow that upon myself. However, it's not so cute. And I d like, I like, I will wake up feeling so good. I can eat almost not anything, but there are very like certain trigger foods clearly that will like fuck me up and I literally look like I am pregnant. So trying to navigate that world, I know a lot of people struggle with it too. So I started researching a little bit and a lot of people said stevia is a huge no-no, which I've probably had every single day for the past eight years. So I'm like, is that it? I'm like, is it just a mix of different things? Also, there was a ton of articles that said stop having coffee and switch to matcha, so. So I've been getting matcha and instead of stevia, I've been putting honey in it. I don't know what I'm talking about, but we're trying different things. So please like if you understand the struggle that I'm talking about, just comment below any tips or any like things, any advice that you have, I would gladly appreciate it because last night I literally ate like the cleanest meal and I looked pregnant right afterwards and it hurt so bad. I tried peppermint tea, that helped a lot. And then this other like some sort of powder scoop thing my mom said that helps or whatever, I don't know. That also seemed to help. It is a struggle, but hot girls have stomach issues. What can I say? I don't even know, how the fuck did that even start? I don't even know. Anyways, also today we are recording the podcast, pretty basic, but we're starting a little later today. We're having Claudia Saluski on, we love her. And I'm so excited because her team sent me the link to watch her movie before it's out. I wish I had time to watch it before the recording, but I'm so stoked to watch it. We're having her on and then me, Rem, and Cal are also gonna do like a third wheel episode. Like it's good, we've never once done an episode, all three of us, we've had him come on. Like if I'm ever, ever sick and Rem wants someone else to like come on and help her, he always like pulls one for the team and always comes on and he's so sweet. But I've never been there. So I'm really excited to do like a third wheel type situation episode where we can just like talk about anything and everything and stuff. So I'm really excited for recording today, but that's not till later. So I have a little bit of things that I need to do before I leave. And one of those things is to let you know that Casetify is sponsoring this video. You guys know I am obsessed with Casetify. They have such cute, amazing cases. They just sent me some new ones. How cute is this? We have this really cute disco ball one, as well as this one. It says you are exactly where you need to be. It looks like water, like paint when you were a kid. It's super cute. I really like this one. And then also this one that has like a whole bunch of different mushrooms on it. Like so cute. I don't know. These are super fun and I feel like they're perfect for summer. And then they also sent this one and I put it on my phone, but I have a magnet on my phone that I need to get off so the case like looks a little different than how it would look on like this black part right here is the magnet i got it for my car so i could like stick it to the thing but the magnet's not strong enough so then it kind of falls and i got a cheap one and i should have got a much better one point being <laughs> this is the case that i chose it says thank you have a nice day and then at the bottom here it says we're out of office like so cute it also kind of really matches my fit today Cute. And the reason why I love them is not just because they have really cute customizable cases. They're actually really protective. They have military grade drop protection. You can literally drop your phone and not freak out thinking you're going to completely shatter it. Also, they have a ton of products that are made out of different recycled materials. You probably can't read this. But right here, this says, this case is made from 65% recycled material. We love that. Like, do you ever wonder where all the old phone cases go? Like the ones that we used with like the iPhone four, you know what I mean? So go ahead and get yourself a Caseify phone case. I'm gonna have the link in the description box. You don't need a promo code. If you want 15% off, all you have to do is go to www.caseify.com slash Alicia Marie, and you can get 15% off automatically applied at checkout. I love seeing you guys send me your orders and like what you bought through the link. So let me know what you get. This is the one I'm loving right now. But yeah, we love you Caseify. Thank you so much for sponsoring. Comment below what color phone case you have on right now. 
Also, for those of you who are wondering, here's a little OOTD. It's very simple because both the jacket and shorts are from the same place. It's from Mayfair Group. They did send it to me, but this is the cutest thing ever. They sent me like a little brief and I picked it out. And I always forget like cropped, like a cro I just I love a cropped. I don't know, so cute. And then I just have some socks and Air Force Ones. I feel like it goes with the sporty ponytail. I was gonna change for Pretty Basic, but I'm kind of really liking this outfit. I did sleep in the shorts. It's fine. No one will know, even though I literally just told everyone. I think I'm gonna wear this for one episode. I do need to go upstairs and see what I wanna wear for the second episode. But that's the, that's the fit. Heading to the Pretty Basic studio. It is 91 degrees outside. <laughs> I don't know why I decided to wear this. It's so cute, but I don't know why. The only good thing is the air is usually blasting in there because we have to like blast the air before we record. I posted a TikTok. You guys should go follow me. We're in the studio. Dun, da, da, da. Okay, it's kind of hard to see with the lights, but today's guest, Claudia Saluski, another fellow OG YouTuber. Although I swear she just keeps getting cooler and cooler as time goes on. <laughs> so I feel like calling her YouTubers like not like it's like, I just feel like she's so much cooler than that. She's like an it girl, you know? Okay, guys, we just recorded. Hello. Say hello, queen. Hello. Queen. That was a great episode. It did feel oh like God, therapy. I'm so thirsty, my goodness. I don't even know if you guys had any other things you plan on mentioning because we took one topic <laughs> yeah. and like ran with it for like an hour. Oh, yeah, no, yeah. We did. It was so good. Um, I think it's going to be up in a, August 10th. Claudia is setting the burn book. I'm, I'm, I'm like, feeling no pressure. pressure. Yeah, I know. What I feel like I, the theme today was like, like new week, new girl. Yeah. Or like different, or <laughs> yes, like, yes, you yes. know what I mean? Yeah, that needs to be the tagline. Or is it different week, different girl? Which one is it? New, yeah. Wait. <laughs> new week, new girl? <laughs> new week, new girl, different girl. Different week, different girl. What are we feeling? <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> different, different, different. Different, different week, day, different, different gal. Girl is that's cute, that's cute. Different week, different gal. Do you ever write and then you're like, wow, I used to write all the time in school and then you like forget what like normal handwriting looks like? Did I spell different right? No, I'm literally. literally tripping out. No, that's right. Yeah, yeah. Did I it does. F? Two Fs. Yeah, different? Right, yeah. Okay. Cal? Two Fs. <laughs> Can I get a number seven? Just the burger, lettuce wrapped, please. Also, no condiments. No sauce on the burger? Yes. Okay. That'll be it. 678, Amanda. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, Alicia. You're welcome, bitch. Also, am I an idiot? I never realized anywhere else does lettuce wrap other than In N Out. <gasps> like, I've never realized other drive through. Well, a lot of places, like, have shredded lettuce. Oh. Hey, vlog. Sorry, do you have your card? Yes, yes, it's fine. <laughs> I stuttered because you have vlog. Thank you. I'm with Mia. What I eat today. Welcome to the, we ordered what the person in front of us got at the drive-thru. Oh I was God. gonna end. Do you remember that? Yes, that is so good. I did like three. No, mine did. I remember being like, yo, this got views. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> what did we Let's get? Let's bring that back. We got a number seven. But I realized number seven is not this. you don't care. No, I, I do. <laughs> number seven is not the same in every Jack in the Box. So I get the bacon ultimate cheeseburger lettuce wrapped. Why are they no not the same? I don't know. Sometimes it's not that. That makes actual yes. no sense. That actually smells so Shit. good. Do you want a bite? Okay. That's a little autopilot. I'm okay, I'm okay, okay. Oh, it's actually my knee driving. Oh. <laughs> we just had an editing date at Starbucks. We did. And I didn't get much done, unfortunately. And I meant to vlog and I didn't. So I was like, wow, FML. But uh, I got some like text and email shit done, I guess. I was about to be like, I don't think I got anything done, but that's okay. You got some editing done. Well, not really. Oh, so we were just both pretending. <laughs> I was on TikTok for like an hour. <laughs> yeah, and then I kept talking to you. I felt so bad. I was like, I no, keep was distracting Honestly, you. Honestly, most of it, I was just importing footage. Okay, perfect, perfect. This makes me want a Tesla so bad. Are you driving? No, just like, it's, it's so comfy, lighting. the lighting, mm -hmm. this. You know, we can trade. Would you trade for a day? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Everyone's too scared. Everyone's like, oh my god. Everyone's scared. Ashley's one of the only people who's like insured on it and she still is so scared. I'm like, Ash, you're insured. Like it you're not insured. Let's go. <laughs> Switching cars for 24 hours with Mia Sayoko. <laughs> I changed my name back. I know I almost said stammer. Do you hear me, Sutter? I mean, that is my name. She knows my name. What if randomly I just started going by Alicia McDonald? <laughs> <laughs> like I just got rid of Marie. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's like, rebrand much, hey. <laughs> like, oh my god, did she get married? <laughs> oh my god, people would actually think that. Anyways, we're gonna go home. I'm gonna have her raid my closet because I have way too many clothes oh, and I'd love to wait. get rid of them. Yes. And I'm gonna show her a sneak peek of my bedroom. It's not fully done. They were working on it today, but I'm excited to see what else they did yet. It's so mature. We're in the glam room. Mia is 
noticing how bad my walls look because the thing is done. <laughs> like, it's so bad. Everyone's like, what? I'm so excited because I needed to clean out my closet because I had a lot of random stuff. Oh my god, come shopping in my closet. Are these for sale? Sadly, no. <laughs> Surprisingly, though, those are like one of the few sneakers that I've bought that has like gone up in price. Oh. Like, I must have just bought it at the right time. Yeah, I could squeeze. You could squeeze. It looks Wait, like that it with this? Cute. It, it looks like it fits. I just, you always, oh, what are you talking about? I don't know, sometimes, I'm definitely an eight and a half. Okay, but, but those are, six. those are a men's six. Rorika. I told her she should do a, a haul over on her channel, go subscribe. Like that could be a whole video. <laughs> oh yeah, what size is this? A men's six, so it's a seven and a half. Yeah, that's so I'm like, are you an eight? You used to get like nines all the time. And I'd be like, are you in that? Not all the time. Oh, the iconic Steve Matt. I, you know, I just got rid of mine like maybe two years ago. Your combat boots? Yeah, like the combat boots. Oh shit. <laughs> Thanks. You're welcome, bitch. Bye. <laughs>